Nobody said that they, they were in fear. He, of it, he said like, that they were scared. Not to me, he did. We don't feel safe with them here. We don't feel safe with them here. We don't feel safe with them here. I heard him say it, guys. <laughs> Well, you so. didn't have to leave line to come out here with me, right? I didn't well, ask you. Well, I have to because he's yeah. making up false claims. He's saying people are in fear for their life, right? We could have no, he, about that inside. he didn't say that. He said that people didn't want to be filmed. Nobody said that they, they were in fear. He, of he said life. that they were scared. Not to me, he did. We don't feel safe with them here. We don't feel safe with them here. We don't feel safe with them here. I heard him say it. Okay, guys, check out Auditing the USA's channel. I'll put the link to it in the description. He does very good work on dealing with law enforcement. Here's the thing. You cannot trust these police officers. These police officers are not your friends. You're probably saying, hey, why do you keep repeating that? Well, I'm telling you this. You know, people people say we know this and this is how we, we know this because we watch these videos. But when I, when I drive around in Texas, I see people all the time not filming the police. I see people literally complying with unlawful orders stating that the police can do what they want. So people are not getting the message. So I have to come with the fact that I know, right? The fact is the police are corrupt. The fact is you have a right to film the police. The fact is people don't know their rights. That's the truth. Like I can, you can, if, if I stop saying these things and I just start saying, hey, you know, this is what's going on and and, and, and and skip over the fact about the filming and the police are not your friends, then guess what? People are going to start thinking, you don't have to film the cops and all you got to do is just spout your rights without a camera. And then they get beat up because they didn't know they had the right to film the police. So always film the police. All original links in the description. I'll be adding additional commentary and narration under fair use. Okay, stop. Hello. I'm not going to stop. No. I'm not going to stop. Why you take our picture? Why not? Why you want to why you want to do with our picture? I'm taking everything. Why are you recording the resort? Tell us the resort. I'm in federal property, public property. I'm allowed. Well, that's where you are. Cry. Go cry outside. Okay. Let's go cry outside. Yeah, that's what I You know what you go do? You go to the gym and lose some weight. All talk. All talk. All talk. Oh, your boss is already totally taking the picture from the people? I cannot say nothing. Oh, my God. He's telling you it's allowed. It's allowed. It's legal. This is legal. Yeah, you just go, Jim. Go gym. What, what does that mean? No, just go lose this way. Oh, okay. Just go lose. And weight. you grow some hair, okay? Because you, you grow fight. some hair on your head. Yeah. Go lose weight. And you grow some hair on your head. Five hundred fifty-five. Five fifty-five, even right? Yes. So the fact of the matter is, these cops, they're coming in and they're about to, you know, try to tell this dude and lie to his face. People think that when they call the police, that the police can do whatever they want. They think they're going to solve the situation. That's just the way they think. Sometimes they're wrong and sometimes they're right. I mean, we don't, we don't try to see it's recording, but the problem is that he's been uh, engaging in customers, sure. training scenes, and it's the insults back and forth, main calling, uh, body shaming, and stuff like that. Okay, what, what do you need me to do? I will ask him like, if, uh, if it's possible to, to leave, uh, okay. because uh, the sense that he's been creating a scene with the other customers. Okay. Just so you know, I have it all on video, so what he just told you is a complete lie. Okay. Well, Okay. You're lying. I didn't body shame anyone. He okay. body shamed me. I, I, never, I never said that you were the one. I said that he's been back and forth okay. with the customers. So, so here's the deal. Do you, do you need him to leave? Yes or no? Yes. Okay. Right. You'll need to leave. Okay. Here's the deal. Um, We're on federal property. You guys are police. You're not FPS. That's you have no jurisdiction on this property. You have to ask the postmaster to leave. Are you the postmaster? So then you cannot ask me to leave. Of the business that's asking someone no, to leave. you have to ask the postmaster. So call your sergeant down here, and we're going to school you today. Okay. Um, was there something that you were here for? Yeah, I'm here on business. 
Okay. Um, so, what, what was always film the police because it is your First Amendment right to do so. Understand, you have a First Amendment right to freedom of the press. Get back to the video and enjoy. Well, when I'm done recording, I'll handle my business. The customers have been one customer specifically, an Ethiopian man, maybe Somalian. He was yelling, screaming, telling me how fat I was, okay. telling me he's going to pay for me to go to the gym. He's got it wrong. This okay. the no. guy was engaging me. Okay. Who who name uh, grow some hair to someone? Okay. What's that? So who? Are you able to just do whatever business you need to do, and then we can go? Like we'll just leave because if you need to do something, that's right. Fine. But I still want to record. I'm I'm here on business, but okay. I'm recording. This is photography for sure. news purposes yeah. and advertisement. Okay. So if you can continue your filming and do whatever business you need to do, I don't see the issue. Right. So exactly. Let's go do that. Well, I don't need you to hover over me. No, I'm saying, well, I'll leave, but let's just finish whatever business you gotta do, and then... And then like I said, home. when I'm done recording, I'll take care of my business. Okay. Uh, how long do you think you'll be recording for? I don't know. I just... I'm documenting stuff right now. Are you guys aware of Poster 7? Okay. Rules, yes. and re rules and regulations governing the post office? Would you like to grab that so they can read it? Would you like to grab it so they can read it? Oh, man. How can I so do this? So yep. just, just handle your business, whatever you yep. do. Yep. So the fact of the matter is, the police are not your friends. Look, guys, there are cameras in this post office, right? So what is the problem with a U.S. citizen filming in a taxpayer-funded building, which is funded by the public, which is public property, as long as he doesn't go in the areas that is, you know, you know, the manager, these office, these post offices... They, they think that they're above the law. The cops, they think that they're above the law, but we all know that we have a right to film in public. And I think that's the, that's the emphasis on the filming because that's the main thing. Without you, what's the point of spouting your rights if you're not filming it? Get back to the video, guys, and enjoy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So this is public property. You can't trespass me from public property. Okay. And I do have business here. I was trying to buy some stamps. He refused me service. So I'd like to go inside and buy my stamps. I'll be on my way. If you want to buy your stamps in there, that's fine. I okay. don't have a problem with sure. that. Do you have an ID or anything that you want to identify yourself? What would I need ID for? Just to identify that you and I had this conversation so I can document it in What's the What's the reasonable articular submission? I don't have it other okay. than just asking who you are so uh -huh. I can document it in the call that we've had this conversation. That's but it. why would you need my identification? Just so I can identify you in the call. Uh, so if you, I don't need you to give me your card right. or anything like that. Just what you want me to call you as. Sure. That's fine. Um, you know, I'd rather not say. Okay. So the, the moment you start talking to the police, you are at risk of going to jail. And here's why. Anything you say can be used against you in the court of law. If you mistakenly said something that you didn't mean the cops will use it against you. They don't care about the meaning as long as you said it. <laughs> Fine, I don't need it. Uh, um, if you have business I to do. do I was there, in line, and now I have to go back to the end of the line unless right. uh, you okay. can get me to the front of the line. I can't do that. Okay, well. So do you want to buy your stamps here? I mean, there's a thousand other places to so buy So I'm stamps. trying to buy my stamp. I'm going to get out of the road yeah, so I don't get hit. There's, a different, there's a, many different areas for you to buy stamps. Sure. Right? 
any grocery store will sell I you happened stamps. to be in the area. I stopped here. Okay. I went to go buy my stamps. I was in line. I was nearly third person from the counter. Mm -hmm. And then he ran outside and grabbed you guys. Well, so. you didn't have to leave line to come out here with me, right? I didn't well, ask you. Well, I that. have to because he's yeah. making up false claims. He's saying people are in fear for their life, right? No, he, about did, that he didn't say that. He said that people didn't want to be filmed. Nobody said that they, they were in He said life. that they were scared. Not to me, he didn't. We don't feel safe for them here. We don't feel safe for them here. We don't feel safe for them here. I heard him say it. Not to me, he didn't. Camera doesn't lie. I, I, I just want to make that known. The camera doesn't lie. I, okay? I don't disagree with that. Well, he but, might have not said fear, but he did say they were scared or worried or something along those lines. So, okay. who are you again? I'm Sergeant PC. What's your badge number? Uh, Sergeant 24. Okay. How about you? I'm Officer Paul. Badge number P five nine two. Okay, and how about you? Okay, so you're saying I can go in and get my stamps? If you have a official business to do in there, I can't keep. You right, but I have to go them. back to the end of the line, and this guy is not comfortable with me recording. I didn't ask you to leave the line, so yes, I guess you have to go to the end. I of have line. to. There's no choice. But when he's coming out here and making false allegations, that's when it becomes a problem. That was your choice to leave the line. And, yeah, because he's making a false allegation. I would have come and talked to you to get your side of the story. Right, but. I'm so here's the thing. These cops, they're, they're trying their very best to get this man arrested. That's what they want. What they really want is to put him in jail because he's not following their directions. That's what they want. They're masking in under a friendly smile. These cops are snakes. Get back to the video, guys. I have to make sure, I have to protect myself, you have right? to is what you chose to do. That's correct. No, this is why the camera's here. We have to protect ourselves okay. because people lie. And then you go off what they say, you write a statement, and you develop false charges. Okay. And you just send it to the court and that's it. It's my word against yours, but if I have the camera, right. you can't lie, right? Did they ask you to stop filming inside? He did, okay. several times. And but well, you chose not to? He doesn't have the right to tell me not to stop filming. Okay. Understand, this is a public building. Right, it's the, a federal building, yeah. Right, which is public. Public, yes or no? Yes. It's However, open to the public, yes. but it's a private entity. Does that make sense? It's not a private entity. No, it's not. This is a public facility. So, they asked, I guess my understanding is they asked you to stop filming because customers were saying they, you made them uncomfortable filming. So I'm standing in line with my camera. My camera's facing the direction of the counter. So if someone feels uncomfortable, they're welcome to leave or go to another post office. I can't... Same as you, though. So here's the thing, when you're dealing with the cops, you have to film them. First Amendment auditors are not breaking the law, you know what I mean, when they're doing audits. The only way they'll get arrested is they're being falsely accused of a crime. A lot of cops are power hungry, and what they want to do is ruin your life. That's what they want. So it's important that you know your rights while dealing with law enforcement in the United States. The fact is, these guys are not your friends. You can't trust them. If you didn't film it, it didn't happen. Get back to the video and enjoy. I can't control their feelings, right? No, I don't have, I don't have ill will, okay. ill intent. My, like I said, I'm here to buy stamps. That's all I'm here for. I need a, a dozen stamps. You can do that at self service. Self service? Uh, you can buy a whole dozen stamps at self service. Okay. Well, I've never done that before, so I, I go through the counter, but. Bottom line is, I mean, when people start saying they're they're afraid and blah blah blah, I mean, we we're getting a realm of, you know. Well, there's and, a certain aspect of people that don't like to be filmed, and that's as simple as that. Right, is. but my camera is not like I'm not turning the camera at the people behind me. I'm facing the direction of the counter. Don't so. About the people that are sitting in front of you. That's you know, it depends, you know. Do you like it? I wouldn't care. I wouldn't care because people have the right to record in public. Right, but you, again, you understood this is open to the public, but they have rules themselves. Right, and okay. have you read the rules? Because I have. Ask, that's why I asked that. No, are rules. you aware of Poster 7? Yes or no? Aware of what? Poster 7. No, what's Poster 7? Poster 7 is for people that are able to record in public. Okay. So Poster 7 is basically, you know, you can, you're allowed to record in the... Again, building is open to the public, but they have their own set of rules, right? 
So what we're trying to find out if one of those rules is you are not allowed to record inside. That's what we're trying to find out. Sir, so they are fine with you going in, uh -huh. doing your business, like you and I have already said. Sure. I don't have a problem with that. You are going to have to go to the back of the line because Correct. you chose to leave the line when you Unfortunately, did. Unfortunately, I had to. So that, And that's fine. I mean, right. that's the choice that you made. So you can go in there, do the business that you need to do, okay. and we are leaving. That's fine. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Thank Great. You. Thank you. Fun. Yep. So guys, these cops are not your friends. And I'm gonna tell you this right now, the police do not respect you. I always tell you guys to film the police. All original links in the description. Check out Auditing the USA channel, links in the description, guys. These cops are out of control. So all original links in the description. Check out the community tab at 3 p.m. Send the time I have to do my best to share videos to there. And guys, I'm trying to do some things with this channel, get it back on track. Um, most likely, I'll be back out in the field. I'm still dealing with court stuff, so unfortunately, there's not much I can do. You know what I mean? There ain't much that I can do right now. So all I got to do is sit here and just do what I can, right? All there is no links in the description. I'm out, guys. Peace, and uh, yeah. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye now.